Well, hopefully the printer isn't too loud. I do apologize for that, but it's going to be printing for like the next two days straight. It's already printed for 36 hours, so, uh, can't really stop it, but I have some mail here. I have, uh, I have actually no idea what this is. It has a customs declaration thing, so... It's a Boomco Railroad loaded. Okay, I know who this came from now. This is from Homely. He sent me this a while ago. I've wanted one of these things, but I've never actually got my hands on one. It's basically a thing to attach to the rail of your Boomco Blaster, and these darts, when they're set in here, and it's got enough for 20, it comes with 10, when it's in your blaster, will actually give you... It's the perfect spacing for a magazine or one of the Boomco clips to reload into it. Which is relatively cool, I would think. Oh, it even, like, splits apart. Oh, that's interesting. That's really, really interesting. I have never seen one of these before in person. I don't think they're relatively that rare, but they are something that I didn't have. And I like how nice and compact it is. So you can carry, like, it's basically like a clip for your clip. That's really, really cool. Thank you very much for that, Homely. I do appreciate it. I know you said you were sending this to me, and I had no idea when I was going to get it, and now I have it. Ooh! Anything else in there? Well, hello there! Alright, I didn't want to read that note out loud, because that was a little bit personal. That was from the Foam Mandalorian. I do appreciate this. And I will, uh, hopefully they can contact me on Facebook or something so I can give a talk to them. This is really awesome. This is perfect to go with that other Maverick. And this is actually moddable to a certain extent. So maybe I will do something with it. I like how that's all been... Oh, it, it's very, very well done. This is very, very nice. Thank you so much for that. I love pink. It's my favorite color. Uh, hopefully there's nothing breakable in here because there's a lot of movement in here. This one was sent by a mat. Let's see what's inside this thing. Well, that explains all the movement. Oh my god, little springs like this are always super important. Thank you so much. I'm gonna move that out because it had an address on it. Letter. From the box, I hope you recognize who this package is from. Just say some things out together with you in the mind. Hopefully get to beat the get the Diatron mod video now. I'm guessing there's a Diatron in there, so that means I can finally mod one of those. Crimson Bison Inc. YouTube. P.S. Still a little upset the parents... Your parents hatched on you? Oh! <laughs> your parents hatched you on four days before me. Oh, so your birthday must be a couple of days before mine. I get it. Well then, uh... I've got some more Pez dispensers to add to the collection. Do I already have these? I have a... No, these are definitely from a different Transformers, I believe. Because that is not the same Optimus Prime I have. This is from a very much different thing. I thought I had this Megatron, though. I have a Megatron and an Optimus Prime already, but I definitely don't have that guy. No idea what that's about. This is a cartoon magazine thing that's got, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! and stuff in. I have... Basically, no idea. I didn't have Disney growing up. Uh, we grew up kind of poor, so we had uh, Cartoon Network, and that was pretty much it. I have no I, That's random as heck. I'm going to thumb through that later. I've got Trunks in his Super Saiyan form. Let's see. Your drills are not discarded when advancing from this level. Whenever you play a card with Sword in the title, Rejuvenate 1. Power. Use when entering combat. Search your life deck for a non-styled card and place it in the play. I remember when Burger King had these when I was a freaking kid, but I don't think I ever met anybody who was actually playing the game. So I have absolutely no idea how this game is played. And of course, the lover-lovable Jigglypuff Gold card. This one's a little roughed up, but that just means I can do something with it. And what could I do with this Jigglypuff Gold card? This is a Predator card. Like one of those old-timey Pops. Not the Tops. Like one of those old-timey Tops. This one's from Kenner, 1994. Of the Predator. Well, that's definitely interesting. Way better than Alien, in my opinion. Uh, stock off of a uh, Recon. Uh, this is uh, Solio. Uh, download McPlay. Scan your toy, unlock a game. That is uh, Polio, I think is what it's called. And that is a Pikachu. No Jigglypuff. There is, uh, 
some kind of Dinobot figure. Uh, never watched Beast Wars that much, unfortunately, so I don't reckon- That is a lot of springs! Like, for real! That is a ton of springs! And they're very, very stiff. I don't think I'll ever need a catch spring ever again. And I'm guessing what's in here is, of course... Oh god, there's still more springs! Get out of the soap aisle! Alright, you don't have to shout at me! I don't know what that's for. There's still more springs! What star are you at? I'm at spring! What do you mean you're at spring? I'm at the spring store! Why are you trying to buy clothes at the spring store? Okay, anyway, it's the Dinatron! These are not that rare, but for some reason I could never seem to get my hands on another one, and people have been asking for a Diatron kind of mod guide thing, and I've done it once before. The original guide that I used, which was, I think, 100% text-based, has uh, disappeared off the internet. But, we do have a Diatron here, and the, they, while they are tricky, I will say, to kind of take apart and get together, because you have to prime it, which is not fun, and the last time I tried to do this was when I very first started my channel, I had this thing slammed down on my finger, and it really hurt, and uh, I never tried again. So yes, Crimson Bikes and Ink, I will be doing a Diatron mod guide relatively soon. Thank you very much for the Diatron. I like this thing. I always call it the Diatron, because media, dia, but I guess it's Diatron, so what the heck ever. <laughs> not gonna lie, I don't feel good at all right now. Hopefully, my camera is picking this up okay, and the audio is okay. Uh, again, this is my new little action camera that I've been using for everything. Happen to like it a lot, and I figured, since I don't feel good, might as well do this fan mail unboxing. That way I can uh, just sit here and edit all day, and actually put something out instead of nothing. So, uh, this will be interesting. Very, very interesting. Because I have a little idea of what's in some of these, but really, not much. So, let's get started. We're in, and this, ooh, I see, ooh, well, uh, that's gonna be useful. This is from Mr. Sonic, who has donated quite a bit to the channel recently. I, he decided to give me some wood filament. I have no idea what to use this for, I, I, but my printer's been doing really good recently, so. Hopefully, I can just use this for, uh, I really don't know. Uh, give me some ideas of what to print with this, because, I mean, I, <laughs> maybe a wood flywheel cage would be awesome. That way, when it heats up, it just makes everything smell like wood. That'd be awesome. Holy crap. What else do we got? This is very, very heavy. Oh, that is perfect. That is absolutely what I needed. I was out of wire, and this really freaking helps. He asked me, oops. He asked me if there was anything I needed, and I said, like, you know, any tools. I was like, filament, wire. That's exactly what he sent me. Thank you very much. What's in this last box? There's a... What the heck is this? Even more filament. Is this PLA? What does it say on the box? Uh, yes, it is PLA. This is also in blue. That's absolutely awesome! Screaming from a panda. Screaming from a panda. Screaming from a panda. Screaming from a panda. Well then! Thank you very much, Mr. Sonic! Holy crap! That is going to be incredibly useful. Uh, very useful. I'm very excited to use this PLA. Very, very excited. Another big box from Amazon. Let's see what's in this one. Uh, holy crap, darts! Oh, oh, darts are very useful. These are from Ray Squad. Oh my god, they sent me a crap load, dude. Holy crap! Holy crap! I'm like set on darts forever! And they're like AccuFakes, which is exactly what I want. And they're in black, so they're going to be even harder for people to dodge. Holy balls! Oh, there's no note in here. I believe these are sent from Ray Squad themselves. 
Oh my god! There's like a freaking billion darts here. Wow! I am, uh... I am very, very happy with this. I really needed darts. Holy crap. Thank you so much, Ray Squad. Here's another Amazon box. What's in this one? Well, that's a beautiful wrapping job. Pretty sure this one's for Mr. Sonic because he sent me to these. Sent me these last time. These are delicious. These are very, very delicious. <laughs> I didn't think he would actually do it. Oh wow. This. Oh my god. Okay, well. This is the Gashicon Key Slasher from Common Rider X8. And this is uh <laughs> I'm going to build this, I'm going to build a blaster out of this, 100%. Does it have batteries in it already? No, it doesn't. I need to put batteries in this really quick. You know, for being so small, the grip is fairly nice. It's not bad. I'm going to put batteries in it. Oh, God. I see how this works. This is where I lose everyone, because they, uh have zero interest in my nerditry. This makes me so happy. Our local group is called the Dart Rangers and <laughs> I'm gonna be the, uh, the common nerfer, the mass nerfer. Oh my god. This is way too much fun. So the, the only thing the only thing we really care about is obviously what happens when we put the uh gashats in here. No holes for me to see. I wonder how it knew that was uh, those two gashats. That's really This is so freaking cool. is officially the coolest freaking thing ever. I am, uh, I'm going to build this into a blaster, so look forward to that. Uh, holy crap. Thank you so much, Mr. Sonic. Holy actual crap. And this is something I need for a project. Um, this is actually for a build. I have the, uh, the D-cell battery version of this, and to be quite honest, it's not powerful enough, but seeing as how this is 12 volt, this should be more powerful and thus be a lot better for what I have planned. This means I can continue my research into exactly what this could be for. I'll give you one guess. I mean, most of you are already like, oh, I already know what that's for. And you might be wrong, you might be right, but it's going to be extremely, extremely useful. So thank you. You have helped me out in multiple ways. You've not only made me extremely happy, 
you've not only made me have cheesecake bites, but you also sent me something that, well, multiple things, tools that I can use to complete uh, videos, and that is super important. Uh, you have no idea how much this helps me. Thank you. Um, I, I honestly don't know what else I could freaking possibly say. I owe you one, for sure. I definitely owe you one. And uh, you should uh, should watch Common Rider X8. This last box is so freaking big, I can't fit it on the table. This one is sent to me by freaking Homely, and I can only imagine what's in here. I have an idea, I think he told me about this one, but found the note. I finally gotten off my ass to send you this long promise package. It includes the promised nemesis that we have discussed. I've also thrown a few goodies and some surprises for you to enjoy. I hope you can make use of everything. Well, that is the freaking craziest fan mail package I think I've gotten so far. A nemesis? What the heck am I gonna do with the nemesis? Oh, there's a lot of stuff. Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay. Oh my god. You can't see this. Oh, 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 I see. Oh, 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 okay, all right, one at a time. Gummy bears. I actually had some of these when I was with Captain Xavier. Uh, like, we got them at a Goodwill. Uh, these are exceedingly delicious gummy bears. And now I don't have to share them with Captain Xavier. So thank you very much. You are an evil, evil man. Reese's Peanut Butter Cups are like my favorite. There's 60 of them in here, and now I have to hide these from the wife because she will eat literally the entire bag in one sitting. Not only do you send me the blaster, which I've seen a couple of times, but I've never owned, but you send me a refill pack to go with it. Not only do I get to do the video on this, but I also get to use it in a war. Holy crap, don't wanna to do too much on this, but this is a Koosh Ball Blaster. Holy crap. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Jumbo Twists Red Vines. I love Red Vines, I've never seen Jumbo Twists. Oh my gosh. Oh, so much candy. Well, there's most of the weight in the package right there. These are not cheap. Thank you. Holy crap, thank you. Mystery number three of three and mystery number two of three peeps. I love peeps, it's one of my favorite candies. And I have no idea what these are and they're also mystery flavored, so that'll be fun. Uh, I t it's hard enough to tell what flavor they are normally, so this will be an interesting guessing game. A friggin' monorail blaster! A freaking monorail blaster. Well then. Wasn't planning on ever seeing another one of these because they went out of stock at my local Kmart and my local Kmart never got them back in. And this is one of the coolest blasters ever. So, uh, that's awesome. That is, I, oh, I know what I want to do with this. And it has to be done now. Oh boy. Gee, I wonder what these are. Are these the 22 Dark Mags? I don't have any of the 22 Dark Mags. I, I'm pretty sure, yeah, these are 22 Dark Mags. Holy crap, thank you. I've never used these before. 
Oh, and is there two of them? Oh, there's two of them! I didn't even have to go very far to know what I wanted to put these into. That is just comically ridiculous. 42 darts in a little over a second. Oh boy. Oh, here's the final missing number of mystery peeps. And last, but certainly not freaking least, I can't even fit it on the table, a nemesis. A blaster I wasn't sure I was ever actually going to be able to get. I don't have one. I believe he got this from a good deal. This is absolutely crazy. This is one of the most insane boxes I've ever gotten. Candy, toys, stuff I can do videos on. I actually don't even know what I'm going to do with this. Can I even do I'm going to have to do a video on the uh, Nemesis. I, it's, <laughs> I'm a little bit late to the party, that's for sure, but that is, uh, I, I've played with one before for not a whole very long, but, uh, holy crap. I am, uh, I'm unsure of what I'm going to do. Thank you, Homely. Thank you so freaking much. I I don't even know. I've got some funny stuff to make videos with and some things to build into new blasters. This is intense. And tons and tons of candy I have to hide from my wife because she will eat all of it. I want to thank everybody for all the beautiful, beautiful things they have sent me. This is, uh, I'm sorry it takes me so long to get these stupid fan mail videos out. I really, really, really appreciate it. I, my gosh, I've been sent enough catch springs to use for the rest of my existence, enough candy to make me puke multiple times, enough blasters to arm a small island nation, and enough batteries to power all of them. I've got a new thing I can do a tag back video on that I'm willing to bet a lot of you probably haven't seen. I just realized this thing's pull and release. That does not sound very powerful at all. But uh, this is going to be a very interesting next couple of weeks. I also have a bunch of stuff I need to show off that I just, like I said, these, this, these, yesterday was, I was completely dead. I didn't get a chance to really do anything. I was sent this from NF Strike, which is the metal priming bar for the op kit that I have, which is really, really nice. I was also sent from Lytake this hammer kit for the Strife, which I already took apart of the Quincy to put this into, but this is the kind that lets you do the whole uh, full auto, but it also lets you do pushing Stefans or half-length darts. And I was also sent a billion parts for a long shot, like the full metal internals kit for a long shot. Like everything I could possibly need. Again, from Lytake. I have a lot of videos coming. I know it's been a little slow. I've also been working really, really hard on my commission. Uh, I think the commission probably stressed me out way too much because it's been a very long waiting time for the uh, person getting the commission. And uh, I, I really appreciate everybody sticking around for this. I'm going to really come out swinging this summer. That's my plan. I have a lot of builds I want to finish, and I want to up the game ever so slightly and hopefully take back my crown because people seem to forget what I'm capable of. So from here on out, I just have to start blowing people's expectations. So, I mean, I'll finally... I mean, once I get that commission done, I'll finally be able to finish this thing, which will definitely make me happy. But, uh, thank you. I know this is long and drawn out and way too long of a video, but thank you very much for all of your continued support. I honestly will never be able to thank people enough for all this. 
it's going to be one heck of a ride, and I really hope you'll join me. This has been Walcom. Thank you very much for watching this video. And I look forward to seeing you in an entirely different one. You gotta.